Hi, this is Pastor Linda Mateo. I came across this disease, Chloroderma, kind of accidentally, which means God had me come across it and said, do a video prayer. He wants to heal people through the prayer. Um, I myself was healed in a miracle, 29 years of very late Lyme disease. And it was in my brain, my nervous system, everywhere. So I know miracles are possible. So I'm asking Father God to use this prayer for miracle healings of scleroderma. Ask the Holy Spirit to come now upon those people listening. Oh, Jesus. So that's the power of the Lord when he's here. My body can't handle all the power, so shakes my head. Rest assured, I'm not getting hurt. So... Holy Spirit, flow to all these people and soften their tissues, their organs, that all the hardness in their organs will be create, we will be canceled, that their organs will become correct the way you designed them to be and be the texture that you want them to be, that they will not be stiff anymore. They will be just right. So I command the organs to unstiffen and to operate correctly. Ooh. In Jesus' mighty name. Oh, I command the skin hardening to go in the mighty name of Jesus. I command the skin to become normal, to be soft, softer and be like it was before this disease. And that disease will come no more. I command the skin to be normal, to be the right thickness, the right texture, as God created it to be. Skin become normal and all that hardening and thickness and stiffness get out. Oh, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Oh, shala. That's his power. He's working. Oh, shala. Father God, you know all the ways that this disease affects people. I ask the Holy Spirit to flow through their bodies and all the connective tissues be made correct, all the stiffness to go in the connective tissues everywhere in their body, that the connective tissues will become normal, normal texture, normal thickness, normal flexibility. And all that excess collagen must go now. Co excess collagen, get out. Oh, Jesus. Excess collagen get out. Oh, shalalala, dematerialize. Ye shalalaha. These connective tissues will become normal again and affliction will not rise again in the mighty name of Jesus. Oh, shalalala, shalalaha. I ask the Holy Spirit to remove any gene that may have caused this, that they inherit only from you now if they've received Jesus. And I'll give you all that later on if you haven't because you're entitled to the healing if you're a child of Christ, but Jesus in his mercy and Father God in his mercy heals everyone. Oh, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Oh, shalalala, I command the immune systems to stop attacking the connective tissues. Immune systems come into divine order and stop attacking the connective tissues now. Stop attacking the connective tissues. Immune system, recognize the tissues that are theirs and stop attacking them. Oh, Immune system, operate correctly as God designed you to operate, to cancel and go after only true disease. Oh, I speak to the hardening of the skin and command it to become soft and flexible again. I speak to the hardening of any organs and command it to operate correctly and to be flexible as God created you to be. And all the excess collagen in the organs and everywhere in their body to dematerialize through the power of the blood of Christ, Holy Spirit flow through all the stiffening, the removing the collagen, the excess collagen. Oh, thank you, Lord. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Lord. Oh, shalalala, hai, shalalala, hai. I speak to the fibroblasts and command them to stop producing too much collagen. Produce just the right amount, fibroblasts, in the name of Jesus. 
I am the Lord that healeth thee. Oh, Jesus. Oh, Shadabahanyu, oh, Shadalaha. I said, I am the Lord that healeth thee, and I shall cure you all your diseases. Oh, Shadalahanyu, oh, Shadalaha, Shadalaha. We thank you, Lord, for your promises. Even before Jesus, in the Old Testament, you have healing scriptures and, and reports of healings. Cancel the spirit of death. Oh, Jesus. In the name of Yeshua, Hamashiach, Son of God, Deliverer, cancel the spirit of death. Oh, Father God, breathe life into them. Breathe life into them. Father, breathe life and more life. Breath of God, come upon you. Breath of God, come upon you. Life of God, the source of life, oh, is Father God. Let his life breathe upon you. I command easy breathing. I command all the scarring that has taken place in any lungs or other organs, the heart, anywhere scarring has taken place. Holy Spirit, please remove the scarring. Scarring dematerialize, get out, be removed through the power of the name of Jesus. Father God, I ask for more life, longer life for them, Father, longer healthy life, Father. There's reports in the Bible, King Nebuchadnezzar, who asked for more life and you gave it to him. You gave him another 15 years, I believe. So I'm asking for more years of life, but healthy life, Father. Oh, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. So I probably should have explained the tongues. <laughs> I have the gift of diverse tongues, and that means it, some of them are for healing. Some of them are for other purposes. So it's more than just the tongues that you pray privately and it is listed in the bible as a gift so um if any of you have been taught otherwise that's what that's about and um i'm sorry i didn't explain it that's the holy spirit praying so i've had the second baptism which is the tongues that came at pentecost so I know that this disease is, um, you know, causes death and uh, most people have 10 to 15 years after diagnosis and some only five. So I'm going to ask all of you who have not received Jesus in the past or even those that have if you want to recommit. It's very simple. You just need a mustard seed of faith, some hope in Lord Jesus. So. Father God sent his son, Jesus, to not condemn us, but to forgive us and to save us so he could open up heaven's doors. There's a song, open, open up heaven's doors, which I could sing, but that's what Jesus did for all of us. And he is the way and he is the light. And um, if you want to be sure where you're going, when you do die, when no, none of us is guaranteed when we're going, to die. So um, you simply say, Jesus, be my Lord and Savior. <clears throat> Come into my heart. Forgive me of all, all my sins. We've all sinned. None of us have not sinned. So <clears throat> I think my throat is catching. <laughs> But, <coughs> I'm sorry, come into my heart, Jesus, be my Lord and Savior, forgive my sins. And that's all it takes, is a cry out to him. And he comes, and then the Holy Spirit lives inside you. The Holy Spirit is the Spirit of God. And the Spirit of God gives life too. So, <laughs> having the Spirit of God in you, 
helps you to heal and to have health. It's not a guarantee, but so I don't want to make this too long. Um, you can listen to it again. Sorry about the coughing. And um, you can decide uh, if you want to receive Jesus if you haven't. And, um, you know, Jesus was Jewish. So uh, don't let that discourage you if you're Jewish, because so is he. And the Christian faith is just a continuation of the Jewish faith. So um, people were expecting a Messiah that would come and have military victory and free them. And, and um, what he's really about is freeing our souls, freeing on us to go to heaven and freeing us from the um, wages of sin so we don't get the um, wrath of God. We get the grace of God, forgiveness, and mercy, and compassion. And the Bible says that we're entitled to the healing. So in the Old Testament, um, healing did occur, but um, the New Testament believers are entitled to it as a right. So. We thank you, Lord God, that you are the God that healeth us, and you are the God that heals all diseases, Lord God. We thank you, Lord, that there's no pain in heaven. So I thank you for anointing this prayer. You can listen to it over and over again. Uh, I myself was healed in incre increments of different symptoms, which were many um 29 years of illness and um so it pays to keep listening and uh in jesus mighty name i also asked to cancel depression because having an illness like this can cause depression and anxiety so i cancel depression and anxiety in the name of yeshua as for the chemicals in their brains that make them feel well and peaceful to come out the peace of the Lord, the peace of the Lord. Oh, thank you, Lord. Thank you, Father. Thank you for your power, Lord. Okay, you can find more prayers on the on Miracles Galore TV show and also a Men Healing Ministry group on Facebook, um, as well as YouTube, Linda Mateo, Amen Healing Ministry. So God bless you all.